What's up, Familia? My name is Isaac, and welcome back to Was That a Good or Was That a Bad Horror Game? Where we check out games from websites such as itch.io, GameJolt, Steam, or if you guys have any short indie horror games you want me to check out, leave a comment down below and you could be responsible for the game that we play next. So, today we're gonna be checking out a game called The Cell, uh, which is like a game inspired by Penumbra, I think? It's like a mixture of like Penumbra style and Escape the Room style, and it's, I've heard of the game Penumbra before, but I've never played it, so if there's some references in there, I probably won't get them. Uh, but let's go ahead and start. It seems like there's no main menu, no nothing. They throw you into the game, and here we go. Alright, so, seems like we're in this little room. Oh, whoa, just grab the bed. Okay, I was trying to figure out what, how we grab stuff. Okay, can we grab, yeah, we can definitely grab this then, right? Okay. Let's put you here. Ooh, look at the beautiful moonlight. Ah, isn't this romantic, guys? Me and you, chilling by this window with the full moon, with the candle right here. You know, kind of nice. Mm -hmm. no, nice. Alright, let's get the candle. Um, uh, whoa, you guys see that? This looks like... Gas or heat is emitting from somewhere? Oh, there's a hole right here. Oh, wait, 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 like, what if this is gas and it lights- Okay, so let's check out what this hole is. Okay, okay. It's a pretty, pretty big hole. Kind of deep. You know, I don't think we can fit in there. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> alright, so... There's a door right here, but I'm pretty sure we can't go through here. It won't open. So maybe we gotta do something with that hole. And I'm seeing a bucket right here. What if we put it in right? Okay, just kind of automatically put, it to, uh, put itself in there. All right. What do we do now? Are we gonna... <laughs> okay. Okay, it seems like a lot of build up, a lot of pressure built up in the bucket and it made it f fly out. It was like, whoa! Flew. It was crazy. Have you guys ever seen a bucket fly? That was my first time. That was pretty crazy. Wait, this is a big brain moment. Check this out. I bet you guys weren't even thinking about this. What if we grab the candle, right? If that's gas, what if we drop the candle in there? Like, we'll like drop it in there quickly, back out. And what if we, us dropping that cat on there creates like an explosion that's gonna, you know, maybe trigger a, trigger a hole to the ground, make the hole bigger, and then we can go down, huh? Bet you guys weren't thinking about that. I'm a freaking genius. Check this out. G -g 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 Drop it. Wait, wait, wait. Drop it. Hey! Uh, what? Critical as asset loss. Oh. You know, I, I, I said I was smart, but, you know, sometimes smart ideas require you to test them and see if they work or they fail. Because if you don't test your ideas, you'll never know if they work. So, it didn't work, and it was pretty bad. Okay, I got it. Alright, so let's put it right here. Stay right here. Um, There's got to be something in this room that I'm not seeing. Am I blind? There's got to be something in here, right? The bucket's not going to do anything because it's just going to like, just going to, it's just going to automatically click in there. I don't even press anything. It just goes in there and it's going to go flying. Let's watch the beautiful bucket fly. That was beautiful. Wait a minute. That wouldn't make any sense. This isn't going to make any sense, but I just want to do it. Okay. It, it's not going to make sense, but I just want to do it. Okay. It's just going to look really cool. Put the bucket in here. No, no. Uh, no. <laughs> what happened? Let's see if we just do this. Will I die? Yep, you die. Okay. Um, well, now we know what happens when we combine these two things, so... It's it's good. I'm, I'm I'm my brain is 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 getting an idea now of what we can do with these things. So this is good. This is good. Do we do here? Ooh, what if we put like the bed for protection? You know? No, no, just there you go. There you go. Oh my god, I'm a freaking genius. Check this out. No! No, 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 no. No, no, no. No. Stay right there. Okay, we got to bring the candle over here so we can get it closely. 
Look at look at the genius at work. This is gonna work. Check this out, guys. Trust me, it's gonna work. Trust me. That the bed's gonna block. I'm a freaking genius. Mm! Told you guys, I'm a freaking genius. Mm. Freedom. Oh, that was it. All right, guys. So we've come to the end of the cell, and that was pretty good. I really enjoyed that. I'm not one to play like escape the room you know, games, but this was really good. It kind of opened me to the idea to check out like other, you know, other Escape the Room games. It was actually really good. I enjoyed it. It was pretty fun. I do wish it would have been longer, but for the amount of time that we got to play it, I don't know. It was, it was kind of fun. I was having fun. Really short, but it was fun. Okay, if I could rate this game between one and five, I would give it a one just because I feel like they could have done a little bit more with this game. Uh, you know, maybe tell a little story of why we're in there. I feel like they could have made the puzzles a little bit more. Um, and I don't know, just feel like they could have done more. But again, I'm not I'm not discrediting like the game at all. It's just, you know, the amount of time, you know, for what we played or what we played, I thought it was really fun. I enjoyed it. All right, being that this game was a little bit short, I do have another game. Okay, dang, that intro is kind of loud though. <laughs> all right, so the next game that we're going to be playing next is called house by the lake okay okay it got some beats uh uh i'ma go real hard on you fools uh look at you with the guy in the cap looking like a tool i don't really care about what you're gonna say uh get out of here uh i'm sorry that was kind of lame um but this beat is really cool i'm gonna be honest this is pretty dope um all right so this game is called the house by the lake and what I read on this game is basically like a murder mystery horror game. Something like that. It looked really cool. And let's just go ahead and jump in. It says, in 2009, a young man named Jason Lee was reported missing. The best friend of the victim informed the police that Jason told him that an individual had threatened him after a misunderstanding at the supermarket. The cameras inside the supermarket didn't catch any disagreements, but it didn't rule out an outside argument. Jason's apartment was searched, and no more information of his whereabouts was found. Until today, the case remains open, but after a year of Jason's disappearance, the case was assigned to the cold case unit since there hasn't been any new leads found. Okay, so yeah, there's like, it's like a murder mystery with some paranormal sounds like? That sounds really cool. Alright, here we go. House by the lake. Oh, here we go. Nice. So it seems like we just start off in a room. Huh. Alright, I see a key right here. Let's grab that. Can we not grab it? Hello? Okay, we can grab the teddy bear, but we can't grab the key. What the heck? Can we take Mr. Teddy Bear? You know. Ooh, ha. This damn storm won't let me sleep, and I think the TV may be turned on. Let me go check it out. Okay, alright, seems like the TV is on. I think we probably left it on. We were like really tired, we just left it on and came into the room and... You know. Woke us up, what the heck, what's going... Hi. That's a weird sounding static sound. Can we get the key now? Okay, I think we're gonna be getting the key, but not right now. Okay, let's uh, let's just keep going. I don't wanna get distracted. Let's just turn on the lights. Do 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 do. Whoa. I I she kind of cute. Whoa. That's a really cool drawing. Holy crap! Look at that. Okay, let's turn off the TV. Shush. Now that the TV is off, I should go back to bed. Okay, yeah, but give me a second. Let me check out. Dude, this drawing is dope. They got a little fox. It's cute. Okay. Oh. Ooh, look. The cloud is not... I'm sorry, the sky is not very friendly. It's bloody red. That's not very good. Okay. I kind of like this art style or like this graphic style. looks really cool. Is it... Is it pixel? Pixelated realistic? Is that what you would call it? I don't know, but it looks really cool. Okay, I guess 
Uh, we can go back to bed and go to sleep. So wait, what's over here? I think this is the main, uh, the main room. All right, well, ah, WTF? The TV's back on. I hope this storm doesn't damage it. Um. Okay, what the? Stop TV. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna wait out the storm. Time to brew some coffee. Or, or, we can get a better alternative. How about we get some hot chocolate? Hot chocolate is a hundred times better than, than coffee. Oh, I like that. That's really cool. It has like a little, like a little sonar effect to let you know like where you gotta, you know, where the coffee stuff is. The coffee machine is. Again, I'm more of a hot chocolate guy for like the stormy nights. It's more comfy, you know? You don't get hot chocolate. You know, watch the Harry Potter series if you don't have anything to do for 24 hours. Just kind of have a Harry Potter-thon. Coffee time! This is actually a really... It's kind of a cool little place. I like it. Is, is that where our neighbor lives or what's over there? Okay, seems like the coffee is done. Yep, it's done. Once you hear those... Coffee machine farts, you know the coffee's done. The coffee finished brewing. Time to pour some in the mug and mix it with milk to give it a better taste before drinking it. Uh, well, let's grab the mug. I'm more of an iced coffee kind of guy. Am I weird? Ice, iced coffee's pretty cool. C can I grab it? Oh, I guess we're supposed to grab this and then we pour it in there. Oh, yeah. Hmm, this coffee smells great. It's just like, it just needs milk. And it's gonna be the perfect energy boost I need. Okay, let's get some milks. Milk, milk, milk. Here the milk. Pour the milk. Coffee is fully mixed and ready. It's time to drink it. Here we go. Uh. You guys heard that, right? Sound like a door open. Yep, the door did open. Alright, just give me a second. Let me finish my coffee. <sighs> oh, God, it's really good. Alright, just one more sip for the road. <sighs> okay. Okay, seems like we can't put the coffee down, so I guess we're going to take the coffee with us. Whatever's in that room, you, you better be careful. I, had a, I have a hot brewing coffee at hand. I can just throw it at your face. Oh. Do you guys see that drawing? That picture? Boobies. <laughs> what the frick was that? This damn storm got me all shaken up. Look at the mess now. Let me grab a st uh, the stain remover sprayer and sponge to clean this mess up before my new carpet gets a permanent coffee stain on it. I think that's least of our worries. We saw something outside. We shouldn't be worrying about the th the new carpet. Oh, fine, whatever. Oh boy, something's out. Something is outside. Oh. Okay. And right, let's get this uh, the sponge. Get the sponge. And then we're gonna get this the spray. Should be down here, right? No? Close that. Where's the... the sp... Sigh! Okay, it's gonna be in the bathroom. Yes, yes, yes. I see the sensor thing right here. Yep. Grab it. Okay. Alright. Can we... Oh, we can crouch. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't know we could... We had a crunch function. Alright, time to clean up the mess. Do, 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 do. How do we spray? How do we spray? Probably should have look. Okay. Oh, okay. We're supposed to do this. We're supposed to crouch. There we go. Yep. Cleaning the carpet. Cleaning the carpet from messes. Uh, I'll clean now. Let's go to the cleaning supply back under the bathroom sink. Okay. Yep. All right, let's uncrouch. And let's go ahead and drop the cleaning supplies. Do 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 do. do. Put the stuff away. There we go. Aren't we gonna like, you know, clean the sponge from the mess? We just, you know, we, I feel like that's just gonna spread all over the, you know, the, the furniture or the, 
sink furniture and it's just gonna be no we're just gonna leave it as it is it seems now i need to grab the coffee mug from the floor and take it back to the kitchen okay let's go you know what, let's see crouching i heard it's a good exercise if you crouch walk it's gonna be a good exercise for for your legs all right well i guess we go back to your room and relax and pretend like nothing happened and completely ignore the fact that we some that we saw something outside that window and you know just relax Alright, so maybe we're supposed to watch some TV. Some television. Oh man, the new Jujutsu Kaisen episode came out. Let me watch it. I want to sit down and watch. Okay. <gasps> Hi! Uh... How is it that only the spooky kid outside in the front yard and me... <laughs> are frozen and everything else is working perfectly fine what okay i think i'm gonna have to restart it guys okay here we are again and you know what this time i'm not gonna go to the bathroom first i'm actually gonna go to the kitchen first wait no that that wouldn't make any sense because we place both the sponge and the spray in the kit in the in the kit in the bathroom so please don't freeze up please Okay, it's frozen again. Ah, oh, come on, dude. I was... Oh, I was really liking this. Am I maybe pressing a button? Okay, I clicked every button and the character is not on freezing. Um, I don't know. This is the third time it's frozen in this spot for me. And I just don't understand. I don't understand. Okay, so I'm going to leave it as it is. I don't want to keep on trying and, you know, getting the same result. This is literally my third time and it's frozen on the same spot. So, probably there's something with my computer or maybe the game. But my thoughts on the game, personally, I like this game. This was, this was a really cool game. I like the little story you had. I wanted to figure out what was going on. And I'm still very curious about the key that we saw in our room when we first woke up. What does that key do? So it just kind of left me with a lot of questions. It had a really nice, kind of spoopy environment. Not so like creepy and stuff, but it was pretty good. I like the environment. I like the, is it proper to call it pixel realistic style? Let me know, leave a comment down below if that's what the style is called. But I like the graphic style. To me, it looked like pixel realistic. Uh, but overall, I enjoyed the game. If I could rate this game between one and five, I would give it a 2, but I'm going to have to drop it to 1.5 just because it keeps freezing up. But if this game... I mean, it could have been a 2.5 if, if I just, you know, we continued through the whole story. But because of the situation, the issue, I'm going to give it a 1.5. The game was really great. Really unfortunate about the glitch that it just keep having. But the game was really good. I enjoyed it. And yeah. Alright, but I do want to say thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And if you want to support the channel, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys later, Familia. Bye!